Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, in the last video we ran a... Uh, wait. No, in the last episode we got all these tools and everything. That's it. So, looking at our levels, we're a little bit behind in this. So the first thing's the catalyst. So, I grabbed one of these mystery essence and... Okay, there we go. Was that it? Or applying? Okay, so I need to make crystal. Probably need two. Let me make them. And after a little bit of time, we've done it, guys. We've got all the stuff here. Except for an anvil, apparently. The anvils just disappear. And with this, load anvil, we need XP. Man. And after a little bit of trading, we managed to complete it. So let's see what our reward is. Just a, another catalyst. Okay. But as you can see, it has a insta stable but basically that if it reaches too much the crystal I'm not sure if it breaks or the vault is just terrible so so sometimes they can be quite nice like now 20% more walls but I get a negative when modifier which isn't always nice let's see architect seal so we need knowledge chart. Uh, nine of those and six of these. Oh, and one of these blank seals. There. There we go. You also want to be put on the crystal. Eight. <laughs> okay, but hmm. I think you need some family. Let me get some more villagers. Here we are. Even more villager trading and farming, and we've got done it. Complete that. Then what's this one? Apply and inscribe to a you like that nice then we've completed this so we get two mod boxes four echo gems sour orange some minutes in the vault not too bad and then 12 bamboo then the gods let's see Iden, the god of battle, Tinos, the god of knowledge, Velara, god of life, Vin, Vindar, god of time. After 40 levels, you find charms really inside living chests. Okay. So, what's this one? An identified noble charm. Complete a god altar. Okay. Let's see. Do you. Okay. You, huh. Do you sit somewhere or? Okay, there. So it must like, just basically give a higher chance to get that. Okay, let's, let's actually run this vault. Oh, it was mod boxes. Oh, that reminds me. We put everything away. In between episodes, I accidentally opened a mod box and I got another grid. So now we have a another grid. Use this. I'll show you guys what and how it's used. 
what it does. And after a few volts, we managed to find the water. These are harder than the previous ones. The previous ones would like give it a little bit of time. Give this, do that. So let me quickly finish it and then I'll get back to you guys. So after a bit of time guys we managed to do it, so let's Hop back into the overworld and let's see if the quest actually worked. I hope it did. Else, this would have been an annoying trip. Ah. So it worked. Ah. Oh. So good. That vault was really stressful, I have to say. At least we can open up some stuff. And see. Ah, I like my shield more. Might not be better, but still good. Okay, let's see. So we've done most of the stuff. The fine paradox. Old run. Hmm. Let's see what the cost of that is. So, wait. Just double check. Seal of the crater. That's it. Seal of the crater. expensive I don't think we're ready for that yet <laughs> we only have 10 pogs might not sound like a lot but I want to get into mechanism and it won't be fun going into a mod and you don't have anything to really use Or anything ready to play with because if you don't have pox then I don't think we're gonna get very far with it okay there and five more so now we have ten pox or ten sorry ten knowledge stars you know just for fun. Ah. Let's see. So we've got ten right now. Uh, mechanism is six, then if I wanted to get another mod, it would be eighteen for the next one. So I'm going to have to think carefully on, with that. That's not a bad idea. Full compass. That's also not too bad, but for now it's fine. Uh, yeah, I... I don't think there's much... I want to get for now like there's quite a lot of things that would be quite nice like Cagetarium and modular routers is quite fun because Cagetarium you can automate mobs so like mob farms and all of that so that would be great for automation but for now it's fine because we don't have giant that need for more parts and we're not automating 100 crystals per second or whatever let me just see 
full case storage. <laughs> It's actually quite good, I'm running out of space. And maybe if we get mechanism, because it's fun and all having this main central base, but I kind of think if we get mechanism, we should build it like over there or there. We use one of these hardened energy cells because it can connect to this main network that we have and with the storage grid I believe you can do um wait, let's search I can't remember the name but there should be a a portable um, where is it now network transmitter network receiver if I am correct these will allow us to wirelessly transfer our network from one place to another which would be quite nice around here and with this other grid we got Place. with this group we got will allow us to do more I, I do wonder we got this chaos catalyst combined with a vault crystal to add 20 um, random modifiers no no <laughs> Let's just see. <clears throat> okay. So there's quite a bit there. I... I think this is going to be where we end it today, guys. There's not much more I can think of. But next episode and upcoming episodes, I think we should... In between episodes, I'll try and get some of these fused catalysts, some more living, in fact. If I can get some more living catalysts, then we can run a vault, living vault that has a whole bunch of living, or that we get a whole bunch of non adjacent, so that we can automate more machinery and make more use of mods. In the next episode, we'll unlock probably mechanism because I'm trying to decide between mechanism and create because mechanism is quite nice for doubling ores and all of that but me create can also do that it's just like multiple block machinery versus singular block or hmm I'll have to look into which one's better. And then at least now we have power. So we don't have to didn't have to go for something like this. I do think this is where we're gonna end it today, guys. So I hope you all enjoyed this episode and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye now.